This year, we have had a chance to celebrate the genius of Europe's founding fathers. Without their commitment, the Commission will not be able to do its job, and Europe will simply not have achieved so much. No one shows this commitment more than David O'Sullivan. As Secretary General at one of the Commission's most challenging times, he gave the leadership and direction needed to steer the process of Commission reform. He was instrumental in redirecting the Commission towards a new policy agenda as one of the architects of the Lisbon strategy for growth and jobs. And now, as Director General for Trade, David is tirelessly working to keep up the momentum towards a trade agreement not just of benefit to Europeans, but which also promotes the well-being of the poorest of the planet. A fitting goal for a man whose career proves that pragmatism and a social conscience can go hand in hand. I'm delighted that David's work is being recognized by this nomination. The College of Europe is a unique institution, a symbol of European integration in practice. C'est vraiment une expérience qui m'a beaucoup marqué. C'est la première fois que j'ai dû vraiment euh, vivre et, et travailler dans un contexte multilingue et, 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 et multiculturel. Et j'y ai pris le goût et je pense que c'est une des raisons pour laquelle j'ai suivi le métier euh, à la Commission par la suite. Travailler à la Commission est vraiment un énorme privilège parce qu'on peut faire plusieurs carrières à l'intérieur d'une vingtaine d'années. Et effectivement, j'ai pu euh, euh, travailler dans, dans plusieurs directions générales. Euh, j'ai beaucoup aimé tous les jobs que j'ai eus, euh, mais euh, il y a deux moments qui, qui me sont particulièrement chers. Euh, premièrement, j'ai eu le privilège de, de, de concevoir, de lancer et de gérer la mise en œuvre du programme Tempus, qui était la collaboration universitaire euh, entre l'Union européenne de l'époque et puis les, les, les nouveaux pays de l'Est euh, émergents après euh, la chute euh, du, mur, du mur de Berlin. L'autre moment qui m'était particulièrement cher, que, quand j'étais le chef de cabinet de Romano Prodi, j'ai pu travailler avec lui dans, dans, dans l'installation de la commission Prodi. J'ai pu voir comment les commissaires sont nommés, comment les portefeuilles sont imaginés et créés, et finalement comment une commission s'installe, y compris euh, euh, un vote au Parlement. Et là, c'était vraiment un énorme privilège pour tout fonctionnaire de la Commission, finalement, de voir comment un, un collège des commissaires euh, est, est né. I have maybe a regret, which is simply that we have not managed to communicate to public opinion the enthusiasm which we feel inside the Commission for the European project. Uh, we are enthusiastic, idealistic, engaged, sometimes maybe a little bit naively so, but I f it is a source of disappointment to me that we have never managed to communicate, found the way of communicating that to the wider public. Uh, probably it's, it's too much to expect, uh, but it is the one thing that I, 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 I do regret. The first advice I give to anyone who's thinking uh, of having a career in the Commission or the institutions is to have an alternative plan, because frankly, the, the chances of getting a job uh, uh, are, are, are quite slim, given the large number of highly qualified applicants and, and the relatively low number of, of, of positions on offer. So I think it's difficult to say, I would never advise any person to have as their primary goal uh, to work in the institutions. If, you, if, if they have that opportunity, I think it offers a fantastic career. But of course, I hope that students of the college can work for Europe outside the institutions by, by, by being committed to the European ideal, but carrying on their lives in other areas, in business, in, in, in voluntary organizations, in the arts, in the media. Uh, I, I, I think it's a very small proportion of college students who will in the end f work as officials, but I do hope that the experience they have in the college, the, the commitment to Europe, to being citizens of Europe, but also in the 21st century global citizens, uh, is something that will stand to them and carry with them whatever they, career they choose to follow uh, subsequently.